Hey YouTube, it's April Mamedy Girl Speaks, and I hope that you guys saw the video that I did on the Frederick Fakai reparative um, protein reparative treatment mask. If not, you should check it out because it may be something that you can use. Um, this is it here. And um, I just wanted to share with you guys some of the things that I've been putting in my hair um, lately. I don't think, well, as a matter of fact, I don't, not that I don't think, I know that it has no bearing on how this item is working on my hair. I just wanted to show you guys what it is that I'm putting in my hair now. Very simple, nothing complex at all. Um, prior to me using this, this is what I was using. And um, I did a review on this. And at the time, I liked liked it and I would recommend this to someone until I came across this unfortunately this is $30 I think at the time I paid 28 and this was $8.29 and it's a product from the Dominican Republic so you can find this pretty much in any um, beauty supply store but like I said I did like it would recommend it but this is something that I'm really really sold on now. Um, like I said, I just wanted to share some of the products, well all of the products and things that I put, I'm put, i putting in my hair now. Again, I'll say they have no bearing on how soft my hair is because prior to my using the Frederick for Kai, my hair was not as soft as it is now and I had the fairy knots going on, I mean like crazy, the fairy knots like crazy. But I do use a shea butter mixture and in this mixture I have um, coconut oil and um, extra virgin olive oil and I've been using this since I've been natural which is over a year now um, I was using it kind of heavy putting a lot of this stuff on my hair and my hair was always so greasy so I don't use as much now so this will probably last me damn near forever I also put um, lavender and vanilla oil in here but I don't really smell it that much but it has a nice nice smell to it which isn't bad but I use this all the time all the time and I've also been using especially because I twist my hair most of the time more than I do anything with it I use this here is coconut and water coconut oil and water and this is extra virgin olive oil and water and even though I have both the olive oil and the coconut oil in the shea butter mix, I use these um, to spray my hair when my hair starts drying out when I'm doing the twist. I use these. Either one. Whichever one I grab is what I use. Um, that's it pretty much. I don't use it like the next day to style my hair or anything like that. Um, to style my hair, I use other creams that I have. Um, I just use these to wet my hair. In that video also, when I was talking about the Frederick for Kai, I, mean, I showed you this. I don't think I said much about it because there's not much that I can say about it. I'm not sure how it may be working in my hair because I haven't switched to something else. Like I said, I really think out of all the stuff that I'm putting in my hair, what's working for me so well is the Frederick for Kai um, Repavative Treatment Mask. This here is something that someone gave me, so I had, and because I was using the other item by Frederick Lacar, I figured I'd use this. Um, as you can see, it's a smooth hair, um, hydrating hair cream. Um, I've been using it, and like I said, I've been using it really because I have it. So I really can't tell you if it's great or not because I haven't stopped using it to use something else. And then again, like I said, I would have to stop using the Frederick for Kai to tell you how this works. So I just use these pretty much together. And I'm only using this, again, like I said, because I have this. I also, oh my goodness, I swear by this stuff, and I still do. This is another product that I was using in my hair when I was um, perm. And I was using this in my hair because... Um, I was using the shampoo and conditioner, which I did a review on. Um, I love the shampoo and conditioner, which I still have. 
I just put it down for a little bit because I tried to rinse pure. Um, but I love the shampoo, and the shampoo and conditioner. I don't think I've used it in my hair since I've been um, natural. The shampoo and conditioner. This I use all the time. I love it, and I love how it smells. Mmm, mmm, it has a nice, clean, clean smell to it. Um, this I got from Ricky's at the time. I paid fourteen ninety nine for this bottle. It's a leave-in hair moisturizer. I don't really care much for um, liquid leave-in, but I only use this one because, like I said, I um, was using the shampoo and the conditioner, and I just kept the whole line going by getting this. But after I finished this, because I finished this Salerm, and I love Salerm. Salerm is another product that I was using while I was permed. Um, like I said, I have a lot of products that I was using while I was permed. I figured I'd just continue to use them in my natural hair. But this is something that I love. If I had to choose between this and the Salerm, I would definitely choose the Salerm because, again, I really don't care for liquid leave-ins. I like the cream leave-ins. But um, that's all I... Put in my hair really. I can tell pretty much if I like something because of how it made my hair feel when I didn't use it and I could tell the difference. So a lot of times I would buy a product and I would use it and then I would stop using it for a minute and try something else. That's how I can tell whether or not this would, was something that was good for my hair and so forth. And that's but I have to swear so much by the um Keep your mask because my hair is so soft since I've been using it, and I think this has been my fourth time last week. Using it again today will be my fifth time. I have not had a fairy knot since you hear me when I tell you, I mean, not nearly a one at all. Prior to me using I used to get them all the time. I was watching a video um, earlier this morning, and a young lady said she has hand and hair syndrome, which, which I have also, and um. I used to get, I mean, I would put my hair in my hand. See, like, now I could just pretty much do this. And, you know, I mean, I ha it doesn't go straight through because I don't have that kind of hair. But it's not bad. You see, I don't have fairy knots and all that. I mean, before I had the fairy knots so, I mean, bad, child. I wouldn't even go get a scissors. I would just pull them right out. I mean, just pull it right out. Try the Fidget for Kai and see how it works for you. If you try it and you like it, let me know that you like it. You know, especially if you're a natural girl. Especially if you have hair like mine. See, see my hair texture? If you use it and you like it, let me know because I love it. Like I said, my hair has never been this soft. And if you're perm, it definitely will work for you too. You know, um, these are just the things that I'm putting in my hair now. I can't wait to try something else. Like I said, since I've been natural, I tried and I've succeeded. I have not gone out and bought a whole lot of products. I am what I call a product skeptic. I don't believe in buying everything because everything is going to work. And like I said before, especially for my hair. Um, I do like to try new things, but I figure since I already have a whole lot here, try what I have here and see how it works in my natural hair. So far, I haven't, you know, I don't have any complaints with the things that I have. Um, I'll continue to just share with you what it is that I have here when I'm using it, how I like it, um, and that's pretty much it. But if anybody tries this Fetcher for Kai and have natural hair, I really want to know. Especially if you've used it, you tried it, or you, you want to try it, whichever. Just let me know. And those are some of the things, all the things that I put in my hair. Um, now, I can't wait to try other things. I, I don't know what it is I'm going to try, but I just can't wait to try other things. But I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, because like I said, when I did the video on the um, treatment mask, I said, you know what, let me share what, what, what else I'm putting in my hair. But I have to say, I don't think those things, not that I don't think, they are not making my hair soft. Because my hair was not soft prior to. And even though I was using shea butter, coconut oil, and um, the olive oil, I still had fairy knots. So what's up with that? I go use the Fredra for Kai, and boom, fairy knots are gone. Now, I don't know if it's because it's a protein mask. I don't know. 
Like this is definitely working for me. I can't say, and I said it in the other video, I can't say I'm going to always buy this at $28, $30 a pop because it's small. You know, look at the difference. I mean, I'm paying because it's treasure for Kai. Look at the difference. $8.29. You do the math. But then again, if nothing else works, um, nothing else compares to this, then this is what I'll continue to use because I know that it works. So I'm going to end this video here. It's Sunday. I don't know exactly what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. But I hope you all have a um, nice holiday weekend, a safe holiday weekend. And drive sober, sober because they're going to pull you over if you don't. I heard it on TV. I'm, I'm saying it wrong, but I'm going to get it for the next holiday. But um, I just wanted to share it with you guys, what I'm using in my hair um, after my washing condition. And um, thank you for watching this video. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next one. And, of course, I want you all to share and spread love. Enjoy the holiday.